Here's a roundup of the most important deals in venture capital from the past week. Tencent Chairman and CEO Pony Marzirium, an apartment renting platform in China, scored a curve throwing Series A funding round of $621 million. The deal was co led by Warburg Pincus, Tencent, and Sequoia Capital China. The company will use the capital to increase its rental supply, boost supportive services, and invest in technology capacity and employee training, Zirium CEO Sheng Lin said in an interview with Kain Global. Pony.ai is developing self-driving car technologies. James Peng and Ti An Cheng Lu, formerly of Baidu and Google respectively, raised $112 million in series of funding for their new self-driving tech venture, Pony.ai. The startup is developing systems that give cars level 4 autonomy, meaning they can safely drive themselves in suburban and urban environments, and can deal with bad weather. Morningside Venture Capital and Legend Capital led the round. Other investors included a mix of Chinese and Silicon Valley-based funds, including Sequoia Capital China, IDG Capital, Polaris, DCM and Comcast Ventures. Disclosure, Comcast is the owner of NBC Universal, parent company of CNBC and CNBC.com. E-commerce companies are still scoring venture funding, despite Amazon's dominance. In one of the latest deals, Grove Collaborative raised $35 million in a Series C round to sell all-natural home and personal care products direct to consumers. Circle SE raised $31 million in a Series C round led by top-tier capital partners for DevOps tools, or tools that help companies develop and maintain their own software more efficiently. Circle Cheese customer list includes Facebook, Spotify, GoPro, Blue Apron and Coinbase. Industry Ventures, Heavybit and earlier backer scale venture partners, Baseline. Ventures, Harrison Metal and DFJ also joined the round. New York-based Jump Bikes brought dockless bike sharing to the U.S. VCs are still hoping that bike sharing will take off in the U.S. as it has in China, or for that matter, Amsterdam. Jump Bikes, formerly known as Social Bicycles, raised $10 million in a Series A round to grow its service. The New York City startup was the first to offer dockless bike sharing in the U.S. Menlo Ventures led the round joined by Sinewave Ventures and Esther Dyson. The company has most recently rolled out pedal-assist electric bikes, which help riders conquering hills without breaking a sweat. A startup developing collision avoidance technology for commercial drones, Iris Automation, has raised $8 million in a Series A round of funding led by Bessemer Venture Partners and joined by B Partners. John Chambers, former CEO and chairman of Cisco, has a new venture capital firm called JC2. The vaunted tech exec is looking to back startups involved in the Internet of Things, digital communications, security and agriculture. Self-funded JC2 has backed eight companies so far including drone, software developer airware and social media management company Spring LR. Paris-based Ring Capital closed a $170 million fund, TechCrunch reported. Its limited partners included dozens of French angel investors and entrepreneurs, as well as BPI France. Through the programmed investissements d'Avenir, AG2 Alamondiale, Bread, Dunnan and Taikao Capital.